Hey everyone, this is Magnus from Travel Experience TV. Today I am at Stockholm Arlanda flying to Copenhagen. I chose to arrive here a little bit early today so I can make uh, a couple of lounge visits and make a short review for you guys. I hope you will enjoy. I arrived Arlanda Sky City by the Airport Express train from Stockholm Central Station. It's a ride that only takes 20 minutes at a cost of 30 euros. Arlanda Sky City is located between Terminal 4 and 5. Terminal 4 is the domestic terminal and at Terminal 5 most international flights departures. That means that today we are heading for Terminal 5. Okay guys, we're going to take this elevator that's located next to gate 1 at terminal 5. Let's go! We start our lounge tour at the two SAS lounges and begin at the SAS Business Lounge. When entering the lounge, you choose if you have any guests, and as you can see, I'm on my own today. The SAS Business Lounge offers a buffet with cold food and a soup. This kind of food is very usual at SAS Scandinavian lounges, and it's alright, but not very exciting. The only alcohol served in this lounge is wine and beer, both served on a tap. The lounge is quite spacious and during most of the day it's easy to find a seat. The toilet section is nice and clean and offers six lavatories. The SAS Business Lounge doesn't offer a view over the tarmac but instead a nice one over the check-in areas. Okay guys, it's time to change lounge to the SAS Gold Lounge. To enter this lounge you need to be a Star Alliance Gold member or higher. lounge is very bright and offers more separate seats than the business lounge. The food selection is exactly the same as in the business lounge, but in this gold lounge we can choose from a variety of alcoholic drinks. And also the wine selection is much better. It's not possible to get any champagne here, but this sparkling wine is quite good and sure makes the job.
A nice feature is the phone rooms and guest offices. Here you can have a private conversation without disturbing other guests in the lounge or just sit and work in peace. This is what the resting chairs in the quiet zone looks like. The Gold Lounge is the only lounge at Terminal 5 that offers a shower. It's always a good feeling to take a shower before a long flight. Before we continue, I want you to subscribe to the channel and if you think this video is helpful, please hit the like button and comment below. Thank you. Now let's continue with our lounge tour. This lounge offers great views of the tarmac and if you want to do some plane spotting, this is the perfect place. It's time to leave the lounge and to take a walk to the next one. Right behind me we have the Pontus in the Air Lounge at Arlanda Terminal 5. I'm going up right now to have a treat. Follow me. This lounge is at the moment the only American Express lounge in Europe. Another one will soon open at London Heathrow. To enter you need to have a Platinum or Centurion card. The lounge section is located in the middle of two restaurants but still very private and quiet. This is the Platinum section. Not very big, but big enough. And this is what a Centurion section looks like. In the middle of the two lounges we find a newspaper stand. We get to choose food and drinks from this menu. And as you can see, there are a couple of benefits if you have a Centurion card. I chose the veal burger with mashed potatoes and lingon berries. Well, mister, is the food as tasty as you hoped? Homemade pastries and fruits are offered as dessert. A real treat. Now it's time to visit our last lounge today, the Norsken Lounge, located at the same floor as the SAS lounges. This is the only one of the four lounges we can visit with a priority pass. And this is also the lounge you most probably will access when flying business class with carriers not connected to Star Alliance. The lounge is nice, but the drink and food options don't appeal to me. This is what's offered.
try to get a window seat if you are visiting this lounge. The view over runways and tarmac is great. If you can access all lounges, my recommendation is to choose the American Express Lounge for food and the SAS Go Lounge for a shower and alcoholic drinks. If you want to see more videos like this, then click on the screen right now. Make sure that you like and subscribe to Travel Experience TV. See you guys next week.